What's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to Breaking Trucker. He's just going to break bad. TikToker, juicy, thick skin. Thick skin? Thick skin. I, I said it right the first time. <laughs> I can't never get names right. I, I, I just can't. But anyway, juicy, thick skin, of course, made a previous video about how she was only making $700. I'm not paying it out of my pocket. I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. My set, my check was seven hundred dollars. Like she's a rookie driver working for Warner. Now the context of the initial video was to really talk about the seventy-five dollars that she didn't have to pay for the parking where she was there. In this clip, she comes back to explain the seven hundred dollars. No more wasting time. Let's get it. Hold on. What's going on, guys? That is me in that clip talking about how I made $700 uh, probably two weeks ago now. And um, I did not expect for that video to blow up. Not even the video. I didn't expect for that $700 part to blow up. That... I feel like the whole video was taken out of context um, because my point in making the video was in reference to the $75 that my company didn't want to pay. And then they turned around and said they'll pay it, but they'll reimburse me. So that's why I mentioned that I had made $700 because... I didn't want to be reimbursed. I wanted y'all to pay. I wanted them to pay for it because, like I said, my check was seven hundred dollars, and I was already on the struggle bus at the time. So I didn't have seventy five dollars to give a mega, a billion dollar company. You get what I'm saying? And then for them to reimburse me, and then y'all gonna tax my seventy five dollars. So that was my whole point in mentioning the se the, the seven hundred dollars that I had made. Okay, now let's get into why my checks my check was seven hundred dollars. So basically, the loads that I had were no miles, BS loads, and then I also had too much time on those loads. On top of breakdown pay, we don't get paid much for breakdown pay here. There, every week it seems to be either the truck or the trailer. So last week when I had that seven hundred dollar check, it was the trailer. And then that trailer that I actually had, I didn't even end up taking that trailer. So I sat all that time and ended up just getting a whole different trailer. So that was a waste of my time. And then this week, my check was some BS as well. I'm not giving any more numbers. Um, but it was also a terrible check. But this, that week, last week, it was my truck this time. So I got breakdown pay for that. Now, I will say the good thing is you still get paid when you're broke down, but the the way you're going to make money in this industry is by driving, keeping the wheels turning, and they weren't turning, so that's exactly why my check was what it was. I'm not having any crazy deductions taken out. I am not on child support or any of that crazy stuff y'all are out there making up. I had bad loads and I was broke down. That's why my check was $700. Now I'm praying that I have a better week. I, I have a good load right now. I'm waiting to get loaded. So pray for me. But I just want you guys to stay encouraged and don't be um, discouraged by my $700 checks, okay? We drivers, drivers, what do you guys think? Well, let me know in the comments below. What do you guys think? Now, as I said previously in the previous video, you know, rookie drivers is not going to make that much money in the first year. It's a struggle. It's, it's pretty much a struggle. And I understand a lot of you guys love to come in and say, hey, I made more money than that in the first year or whatever, whatever. That's you. Your situation doesn't fall on everybody else's situation. This is a rookie driver. She just came in to Warner, which is a starter company, and they're going to start her at the bottom. And in which case, she explains the $700, which I feel kind of really didn't need an explanation, but she just, you know, going by in the comments because the comments can be savage. I'm just saying. The comments can be 
savage. They came in and tried to figure out a whole mess of things in this young lady, what, what's going on with her money. By the way, by the way, that's her money, $700. I'm not even sure if that's even before or after taxes for that matter. <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm just saying. But in any case, she explained the reason why uh, her money was, was that, you know, breakdown pay, not getting loads, sitting, not moving. And that is the course for mega carriers such as Warner. Because not only that you're a new driver, but you're also a new driver with other new drivers and drivers that's already working for the company. Now, considering the fact that their top tier drivers is going to get the best loads and the best miles, which leaves you with next to nothing, in which case her truck was also broke down. And breakdown pay don't pay much. Companies such as Warner and the rest of them only pay like $50, depending on how long you're there. I was in a situation where I was broke down and I wasn't paid nothing at all. Crazy, right? But it is what it is. She got her $700. Hopefully she would get back on a good foot. Her truck is running. She's back moving. So hopefully, <laughs> hopefully they'll be able to get her together. All right. What do you guys think? What do you guys think in the comments below? Let's jump in the comments. This first commenter says, just leave Warner. I did. And I am much happier for it. Good idea. I mean, you could just pick up and leave, but sometimes it's all about your experience and you're trying to get it. This next commenter says, I hate to be given two days to do a 500 mile run. Exactly. Exactly. I know that feeling, bruh. Two days. Like they give you the low, like, in the middle of the day, like around four o'clock or something like that, you do that. And then it's not dropped off until tomorrow morning. Like, bro, why you can't just find me a load in the morning, drop off in the afternoon and then be ready for the next load the next morning. Stop explaining to social media, your situation in trucking. We know how it goes sometimes. Bam. Exactly. Exactly. A lot of stuff don't really need to be explained to people that you don't even know. This commenter says, I started off with Warner too, but they wasn't like this back then. I guess them fuel prices got them in a hole. <laughs> Shoot, them fuel prices got everybody in a hole, bruh. This commenter says, they'll pay it to get you moving, but believe me, they'll get their money back. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Of course, they're going to pay that $75. Why wouldn't they pay that $75? It's $75. Why would you want to put your driver in a situation like that? And this last commenter says, just gain the experience and move on to a different company. I'm also at Warner. Four months in, and it sucks. Big G's got it locked. Boy. Want you to love me all night? Yeah, take me down. Want you to make me real white? Yeah, swim around. Want you to take it like a G and yeah, I'll make a sound. Security.